there's a quick guide on a animated search bar. So first, we have to start with form. And not be all fingers and thumbs. So, and that, and now we just add a simple input. Grab the head of yourself a little bit, then add a type, then text. <laughs> A name, whatever you want, but search. We're gonna do the. Let's say placeholder is what you would see before you like click on it, wait on it. So I just put whatever. Dot dot dot. And you end up. So now you've done that part. This is where we go to the styling, and it's pretty quick, so don't have to worry too long. And again, we got to use those box types. So type, text. This is where we add the whip. So we want it to be one fixed pixel. So if it's in the already placeholder in, and add the box sizing. For the box. Remember don't go outside of the brackets. Let's add a border to it. So a two pixel solid black egg, whatever you want it to be. Add a bit of radius just to make it look nice. We're gonna do four pixels on size, so it looks you know, so it's got its own thing, so it's not homogenous to everything else, it has its own as I said, fun size. And it can be anything again, what you want. Background colour, white, because usually, you know, most search bars have a white background. The padding. Depending on your own website again, just gives you an idea how to use it. And these are just for the different dimensions, top, bottom, left, right. And the next thing is transition. Oh, remember to add the semicolon. And you got the width 0 0.4 seconds. It can be anything you want. You can as slow as quick as you need it to be. Use in and out. And that. And last thing you gotta do. And as you showed with the hover, you can do focus and then whip. 100%. And now if we quickly run back to it, it should now be animated search bar. Yep, there you go. Click on it. Oop. Seems to have gone too quickly. Probably made a slight error somewhere. Oh, I see. <laughs> there we go. Slight spelling mistake. And now it should. There we go. And when you click over it, it goes back. And now you've got yourself an animated search bar. Obviously, you can control the width and all that you want it to be. So, say that like you want it to be only 50%. Because, you know, don't want to go. <laughs> Most times you don't want to go all across all the website. So there you go, and it will change the shape. So great thing about using percentages over pi over pixels. So yeah, thanks for watching and.